In this video, we will walk through how to receive calls using trunking origination. Trunking origination is the ability to receive a call to a Twilio phone number and have that call be delivered to your PBX. To do this, we will be augmenting our free PBX configuration to configure the appropriate inbound routes. Let's start by configuring our origination settings. We'll log into the console and go to our trunk called Demo Trunk, which we created in our previous video. From here, we will go to Origination Settings and add a new origination URI. We'll point Twilio to my IP address 192.241.205.250 and we'll leave the default priority and wait settings alone. And make sure the origination URI is enabled. All we need now is a phone number that customers can call. We'll add a U.S. phone number to the trunk here. And we're all set. Let's refresh the page to see the number we added. Now, let's jump back to the PBX. We already configured the trunk and the outbound route. The only thing we're missing is an inbound route, so we can receive the call from the Twilio trunk and deliver to the right extension. We need to configure a new inbound route to do this. We'll call it Trunk to PBX. For simplicity, we'll ignore the DID number and caller ID setting, and we'll set the destination to route it to my extension and the extension to 415. Let's test it out. Awesome, we have an incoming call that I can answer. Hello. Now we have a two-way call from my Bria client to PSTN. Check out our next video where we'll set up our PBX to receive calls from around the world.